Good day and welcome back to my video. Today I'm so excited because I am filming like part one of a pack with me. So Ian and I are going to Mexico as I'm sure you've heard a million times. You're like, we get it, we get it. And I love watching pack with me. So like one of my favorite things to do, but I am like uber organized type A, like plan out everything. So I'm doing mine in stages. So the first thing I'm gonna do is see all this, all these clothes up here. So a bunch of these are from summer and then a bunch of these are like winter clothes. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pull all of these clothes and I'm gonna sort them into three piles. Pile number one, bring with me to Mexico. Pile number two are summer stuff that I'm not gonna be wearing in the season. Me and Ian bought a dresser and put it in our storage unit specifically for summer stuff. So all of my pile number two is gonna go down into storage for next summer. Pile number three, staying here in the room for the winter season. So I am going to start with the pack with me with today and then we'll see where we go from there because we got lots more days to go and lots more packing and organizing before we actually get to Mexico but I figured I'm going to be doing this anyways I might as well film it like my adorable outfit this is Shein I went to like an anniversary work party today and this is what I wore so adorable grab your beverage of choice Today mine is just a uh, blackberry bubbly. I have a little snack as well. I have some dried mangoes. I am no longer on keto. So I had a lot of um, parties and stuff to do in the last couple of days and I really, it would have been such a pain in the ass to be on keto and we're leaving soon. So I was like, okay, I'm just gonna stop early. And so here we go, have fun with me. Cheers. So I'm like not even halfway through. I've taken down everything from my top shelf. I have a bunch of shirts that I need to like rehang. And so I need to go through all of my shirts as well and then separate them into, I have a very small pile on the floor of summer clothes that I'm gonna put away. I have a giant pile behind me of summer clothes that I wanna to take to Mexico. So I'm definitely gonna to have to pare that down. And then these are the stuff I have to go through to put either away back in my closet, but I need to figure out like how to fit stuff in my closet properly because I have so many shirts and obviously my boyfriend has tons of shirts too. So I need to start paring stuff down. So wish me luck. Good day and welcome back to my channel. Today is the second series in my pack with me video and listen to that sound. Literally it sounds like air sounds like air brakes or either like an air raid like like mayday mayday watch out um we'll see if you end up hearing this I have my window open because it's nice and fresh um so today I'm gonna go through um all of my bags that I have and everything that I'm gonna be needing for my two weeks in Mexico I've already put aside like most of the stuff that I want to bring clothes wise and it's just sitting in a garbage bag in my closet and so to grab your beverage of choice, mine is Soda Stream that I made fresh just now. Mm, 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 mm. Ah. And let's start. Okay, so I have three bags that I'm bringing. One is like my giant ass travel backpack. So you're allowed a check-on bag and then like a rolly carry-on bag and then one personal item. So this is my personal item. I cheated because look how giant this bag is. It's like a second freaking check-in carry-on, right? So I showed this on my Amazon and I have a bunch of stuff in here that I'm going to take everything out and those will be like my little tiny packing, like my jewelry case and you'll see. You'll see. So I have that, which I haven't used yet. I have my actual carry-on, which I've had forever, which I'm going to be rolling on. And I might actually use, I bought another one because Ian only has giant luggage. So he has probably like four giant suitcases, but not one carry-on. So I have mine, but I purchased another one from Amazon. It should be here on Tuesday. And I will be using the better of the two because I care and Ian doesn't. So this is my carry-on. And then I have this giant bag that I will be taking. Guys, I know I'm ridiculous. I know it's just two weeks, but like, do you know how much joy I get out of this? Do you? Do you? Probably because you're watching this, so you probably get the same joy out of it too. So I'm going to take apart all of these and we'll see what's inside. 
And then I have my pre-pack checklist. So I've made like just like a word doc. I can actually probably link it below so you can use it if you want. And I need to check my VAX requirements if I need my VAX card, which I'm sure I do. Um, double check my airport to the resort. Like I booked one that picks us up at the Cancun airport and then takes us right to our um, all-inclusive. And then I want to download music on both my Spotify and probably my um, tablet as well. Podcasts and movies, definitely. Like, you know, Netflix will be able to let you download. So I'll like download stuff on my tablet. I'm literally watching a pack with me, guys. I'm filming a pack with me for YouTube and watching a pack with me on YouTube. <gasps> Inception, ow, we're just gonna ignore that. Okay, and then I need to confirm my hotel reservation. Print the paperwork and copies of passports and IDs. So I already printed my paperwork, like the flight information and the hotel information, but I do want to take photocopies of our passports and IDs just in case. I already got cash, so I have everything I need. Underwear, 14 pairs. We're there for 14 days, 14 pairs. I can wash. And bras, nude, white, black, strapless sports bra and wireless bra, like, um, like a demi cup, like a soft cup, just to be comfy. Swim, I have 10, I'm bringing 10 bathing suits and I'll legitimately probably bring more. Depends on how many I have. Tops, bodysuit, crop top, overshirt, sleep shirt, and then a warmer shirt, like a long sleeve shirt of any kind. I don't think last time we went to Mexico I ever ended up wearing that, but I should have one ja jacket or like long sleeve shirt for sure. I for sure should. Bottoms, one pair of jeans, Lulu's, jean shorts, jean skirt, Linen shorts and workout shorts, skirts, whatever, dresses, whatever, how many, jackets, probably one jacket and it'll just be like a flight jacket so comfy enough that I could like sleep in it on the plane, maybe a hoodie or like a softer material coat and then something I can bring in Mexico. I think it'll be hot like the whole time we're there so I don't want to bring more than one jacket. Pajamas, which will just be like little shorts and a shirt. Shoes, a shoe bag. I've been saving a bunch of like Shein um, bags because they all of the clothes come in nice bags. So I've been saving them. So I'll just use those to pack. Sandals, flip flop, a pair of nude heels and sneakers. I bought like a um, from Shein little white like short wooden shoes. So I'll be using those. Accessories, a baseball hat, a sun hat. A baseball hat's like just for Ian because he's been getting into wearing baseball hats, which is adorable. He never did before. Sun hat, sunglasses, glasses, purses, backpacks, backpack, belt, scarf, watches. Skincare. So in order of how I take my makeup off and wash my face, my Clinique cleansing oil, face wash, serum, eye cream, lotion, mask, and then I have like SPF and stuff. All my makeup, so primer, foundation, concealer, powder, bronzer, blush, my beauty blender, my beauty blender cleaner, eyeshadow, eyeliner, mascara, and then other things like shampoo, conditioner, body lotion, aloe vera. I still need to pick that up just in case because Ian is English. He's will probably burn, so I need to take care of him. Uh, tweezers, but I'm pretty sure I spelled it Twizzlers here. Sunscreen, perfume, nail clippers, toothbrush, toothpaste, floss, Razor, deodorant, nail file, my hairbrush, elastics, bobby pins, contacts, and my solution. One workout outfit. My cheap gold and silver options. I don't want to bring any nice jewelry. I just don't care. I have so many, so much nice cheap shit. I'm not going to bring anything nice. Um, electronics, computer. I don't think I'm going to bring my computer. I don't think so. I think I'll just bring like my tablet and my phone and that should be good enough. Phone, headphones, tablet, chargers, power bank, Kobo. Books. I want to bring a couple physical books, even though I have my Kobo. I know I'm weird. I know, but something's just nice if you have an actual tangible book. You get it. Um, my passport, driver's license, credit card, insurance, cash, keys, medicine, a sleeping mask, earplugs, my diary, pens, games. Ian plays board games, so he'll probably bring a couple like small games. My guess is Fallout Shelter. We'll probably bring that. I'll show you in our vlog. Um, while we're there. Vitamins, gum, emergency. Speaking of gum, I literally have been craving gum and I was like, can I film while chewing gum? Will that drive people nuts? So if you watch it and it drives you nuts, just comment below. Say it drives me nuts. You know who YouTube YouTubers chew gum, Laura? What are you doing? All right. 
sanitizer and antibacterial wipes and that's it so we're just gonna start we're gonna see what we have in here I'm gonna put this over here I have a new candle from Michael thank you Michael it smells delicious it's Joe Malone it's the first Joe Malone thing I've ever owned and I love it okay so let's see what's in these bags we might as well start with the big one so how are you How's your week been? Mine's been great. I'm supposed to be working right now. I got called off and I'm so excited because I'm going to start doing this. Okay. So we have Banana Boat in here. That's from last time we went in the summer. So I'm going to take all of my sunscreen I have so I can use it. I have a Hawaiian Tropic Dark Tanning Oil from the summer. I have a CeraVe SPF 30 that I brought to the beach at the pool. This summer, I have a trashy mag. Actually, that's a lie. I got two. And I know I got two more here. And I'll probably get two more. Because the only place I read trashy magazines this day and age is on the airplane and poolside. Oh, it feels so good. Something so satisfying about it. Okay. I have a couple books I want to pick out of. One, two, three. I think there's a couple more in here. Four, five, six. So I have six books here that I bought at our local, I think it was Salvation Army. And I bought these for like 12 bucks or something. And I think I have a couple more. Um, so I want to pick two out of these before I do that. There are like, three of them are thrillers. And three of them are like, kind of romancy, like, vacationers kind of thing. So we'll see. We'll do that in a bit. I have a couple... Like nice, like essentially packing bags. This one, this one's from Sephora. Like a couple little ones. So I'm gonna put these to the side for now. So I'll probably end up putting like some of my lotions in some, like my eye stuff in one, yada, yada, yada. All right, I have my white hat and I really wanna bleach this before we go. So I'm gonna take care of that. I also have my bag. This is my beach bag I've shown you before I got from Amazon. I'm also gonna wash that because it has a stain. Okay, I picked out these two belts, just this one, that could either go both here and here. Ah, double trouble, love it. Um, these should not be in here, they should not be in here, I'll put those away later. I have goggles because I'm that girl. Like, why would you not bring goggles to freaking Mexico? Did this just break? No. Oh no, it didn't break. I just had to put it back together. Great. I have some bikinis in here from Shein. These are the bags I was talking about. They'd be good for like shoe bags. I'm pretty sure shoes came in this. So I have a bunch of bathing suits in here. I'm just going to jump out so we can actually count those bathing suits because I literally don't want to bring too many. And I already have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, seven. Here. So. I need three more and I'm going to put them in this like this is going to be probably my laundry bag when we're there. I have no idea where I got this from. So I'm going to put all my bathing suits and a saucy outfit in here. I'm going on vacation with my boyfriend guys. Calm down. And great. Oh, right. And I have one more belt. Just this one. Cute. It'll hold my dresses. I uh, nipped in the waist. I don't know if I'll probably want to do that because I'm going to be eating so much every night. I'm going to be like, no, not around my waist. Okay, I'm just going to put this over here with the mags. I have a mask that I want to wear on the plane. It's like a vital hydra solution mask. So I'll put this like with my backpack and stuff over here. I should start making, that's going to get packed. Um, this will be here. Maybe I'll put all my packing stuff. Okay, great. So this is my old like makeup container to pack. I have a new one now, which you guys have probably seen. And it included this. So I'll probably still use these for something. This is Ian's shorts that he wanted to take back, but he couldn't. He was like, yeah, I'm so excited for these shorts. Look how cool they are. They have magma. And then neither of us noticed on the back it says, stay true like a true douchebag. He's gonna wear them anyways. I couldn't, those are the one thing I couldn't return from Shein because it's like an intimate. So gotta keep that. Next time, buyer beware, pay attention to what you're buying. I just had to move it over. So these are the bags again that I was talking about. So this is for my brushes, my makeup brushes, perfect. I have a pair of flip flops. I have a 
another bag. I have my jewelry, my old jewelry bag that my sister Katie gave me. I'll probably still bring that and the new one. And then this is ointment body spray, i.e. Lotion. Lotion. Okay, so that's empty. Let's see what's in this carry-on. Because I just took all the stuff that I need and kept stuffing it in like more sunscreen. And I just kept stuffing it in here. And then I knew I'd reorganize it later. So Let's see what's in here. I have my sun hat. Sick. Love it. So excited. I have my new camera fan, which works out really well. See, look. Oh, I'm going to sneeze, guys. I lost that last one. I never lose one. See, look. Works well. Very excited. And it has a charger in there. I'll probably end up putting this in my electrics box, which will end up being packed. Okay. I have Tide Pods. Oh, I forgot about this. This is a giant floaty. Last time me and Ian were in Mexico was in November and we bought like, I think it's a chips. I think it's a giant like chip package, but it costs like 40 American dollars or something like that. Like it ended up being like $65 Canadian. I'm like, there's no way I'm leaving this here. So I packed it up, put it in my luggage and now I have to make room to take it back. It takes up so much room. That's sad. That's sad. That's sad. <laughs> okay. What else is in here? Oh, I have the luggage scale, which will be perfect if I'm going to fit a giant floaty in my luggage. All right, so that's the end of this one. Woo. And then we have... I feel like we're missing so much stuff. Here's the clean towels for my face. Here's where everything is. The pill container. I have to put my beach towel in there. Here's the electric electrics container. Here's my jewelry. Here's where everything is. Here's my perfume bottles. The travel ones that I really like that I'm super excited about. Travel size bottles. I have our luggage tags. Beach clamps. I have um, my hanging toiletry case. Yes. Perfection. I'll be filling this. I'm so excited. And then I have the new makeup case, so I'll probably end up using both because I'm a psychopath. Glasses case, also large. Guys, I have so much stuff that takes up so much room, and I literally have, like, a garbage bag full of clothes that I'm staring at that I also want to take. Okay, locks. There's something down here. I'm going to start from the top of the list, which is underwear, and you don't need to see me washing me pack my underwear, so I'm going to do that, and then I'll come right back. And we're back, and I have glasses on. I don't think you've ever seen me in glasses, but I've been wearing my contacts all day, and my eyeshadow is so glittery that I feel like it's getting in my eyeballs, so I had to take my contacts off, out, and put my glasses on. Okay, so I have all of my bras and my underwear, and we're just going to put them in this little pouch right here and then probably put my underwear in these little things right here. All of those just took up one side. All of my underwear just took up one side of this. So I think I'm gonna put bathing suits in here. I'm gonna completely empty this luggage and we are going to move on. 10 bathing suits. Okay, so I just put all of them here and I think I'm gonna keep them in this bag as much as possible and get the air out if I can. And then I'm just going to throw it in for now. And then I have tops, bottoms, skirts, dresses, jackets, pajamas are all pretty much ready to go. So I'm going to move on to the littler stuff like accessories, skincare, makeup, all that. All that such. Okay, so we are going to start with makeup. I wonder if I should scoot you in here. I should, shouldn't I? Yep, let's do that. Welcome in, all scooched up. Okay, so I'm gonna get a really dark spray tan before I go. So we're gonna start with primers and then foundation and concealer, which is how I put it on. So this is like my makeup 
stock. Holy cremoli. Maybe I can put you down in here. So we're going to start with primer. So I'm going to take the most empty, the one, so I can just empty it. So we're going to do Angel Veil, Impossible, and I think that should be enough. Just these two. Yeah, I'm sure I'm not going to go through both of those. And if I do, who cares? I don't need a primer. And then we have foundation. So I'm going to look for my darkest foundation. So I know that I've been putting all my dark stuff in this. This is old. It's not actually Dream Matte Mousse. But what I do is I create my own concoctions with um, foundation and also more like serum foundations. So I'm going to take this. This is really dark. And this will be like kind of like a tinted balm light foundation. I know I have a dark one in here. So I have this toffee caramel, but that's super dark. That's way darker than I'll probably ever be. So I need a mixer for that. So I'm going to find cheap stuff. So like this or this, what else can I bring? I know this is pretty dark. This is usually my tan color. What else? I want something light. Oh, I have the e.l.f. Halo Glow Liquid Filter. This is so dark. It's way too dark for me, but I got it. I, like I ordered three shades online to make sure I got the right shade. So I'll be bringing this. I'll be bringing this. I'll be bringing this and then I need a really white mixer that's good because like this I don't like like I keep trying to try this but I don't like it it doesn't work so what else what is this closest I don't need to bring that um, this is the setting spray that I'm going to be bringing because I don't like it very much so I can just use it up on vacation. I don't overly need setting spray. I'm going to be on the beach and it's usually I'm going to be doing my makeup at night when we're just going out for dinner. I'm going to use this one. I know it's a good foundation um, and it'll be a good mixer. So that's four foundations I'm bringing right then. I'm actually going to be getting new beauty blenders to bring because these ones are old. So I'll just leave these here to use and I will pack fresh ones. Anything else in here that I need? I'm going to be bringing this and washing this. So I have to, I'm going to put that aside. I'm going to probably just get a new one of this. This one's ripped and I have a bunch of them. So I'll do that. Well, I will bring this uh, tiny airbrush flawless foundation in a really dark color because I will like use this as contour or whatever. All right. I also have the debronzing anti-pollution sun dry drops. I will bring these. I didn't like them, but I'll use them in Mexico. And then I also have this primer, and this is an eyelid primer, so I might as well bring those, and I'll try to use those up as well. Great, so that's everything in here. Eye masks. I'm going to be packing these, um, Ian's and mine, but I'm we're going to need them till then, so I'm just going to put them away for now. I'm going to pack this mask as well, facial barrier mask. I'll probably be able to do, I'll have tons of time there, so I'll be able to do it while I'm there. I will not be packing these. I will not be packing these. This is also other masks. Man, I shouldn't pack that many masks. These are old. I have to use them up too. Okay, so I'll probably be packing some of these little tiny hair elastics. And I'm going to go through literally all of these perfume samples and see which ones I like and which ones Ian would like. And I'll pack those. And then there's another one, right? Oh, no. That's garbage. Okay, let's see what else we have. I will be bringing, like, this, these sanitizers. Ian hates the smell of this. I will be bringing them anyway, so I'll be packing those. And these will go in, one will probably go in, like, my carry-on. And then one will go in my checked. Great. Oh, man. I already feel overwhelmed because I want everything. Okay, slow down. All right, I have to pare down my lip liners. So let's see which ones I'm going to bring. For sure, this one and this one, my two favorite Sephora ones. Probably Backseat Love because it's fairly nude. And then just the Buxom Powerline Dolly one because it's purple. So that means I'll only have four. Okay, I have... This like kind of mauve color, I have a like nude color, I have a pink, I have a like spicy or plumping one, and then I have a butter gloss. Great. Done. Whew. Eyeshadow palettes and powders. 
Mm, and we want like bright, like we want a bunch of different stuff. This is a good one to bring. This has a lot of different stuff. And then I'll probably for sure bring my soft glam. It's like my favorite. And I'll, like that makes a million looks. And I'll probably bring a Huda Beauty Coral. Because that'll be great. And I might bring just a pop of color one like this. Or something else. Let's see. Oh, I have my new Anastasia. Uh, it's not really, a, it's more of a fall vibe. It's not really like Mexico vibe. I love this Natasha Denona. Probably not. That takes a lot of effort, right? I'm just, like, I'm going to be at the beach. Mm. Oh, I do love my hanging in Hawaii. I do love that. I might do that. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. This has some nice colors. See, this is how it, it starts, right? I'm like, what should I bring? Let's bring everything. I am going to be bringing my fan, but I'll probably need it before, so I'll leave that here. I will definitely be bringing like a body brush. I'll bring this one because I'm going to be like, as dirty as it sounds, like wet most of the time, and that's my wet body brush. This is my dry one. I am going to bring like a face crystal because I will have time. I need to pack my glasses. I'll probably pack my crappy glasses, which are the ones that I'm wearing, rather than my nicer glasses, which I will show you right now. I've had these ones for like 100 million years. Funny story about those with my ex at some point in time. And then these are my nice ones, but I hardly ever wear these. Let's just wear them now, shall we? Which ones do you like better? Okay, I'm gonna bring this uh, camel powder foundation because it's too dark for me right now, so it'll be perfect. Did I drop? Okay. I'm not gonna bring too many of these giant packages. Ooh, perfect pop of color. All right. So I'm definitely gonna bring this powder and this powder. I think I also want one more, probably the Fit Me pressed. All of these are pressed. I like a loose. They just have so much, like, it takes up so much space. Okay, I'm doing it. I'm bringing it loose. I need a white eyeliner, colored eyeliner, black eyeliner, and then some eyebrows. I have one, two, oh my gosh, three, four, five, six, seven, eight palettes that I was thinking about taking. So let's narrow it down. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. My Tati, Be Tati Beauty is my favorite, but I, I like, I worry about taking it, you know? I worry it'll crack or break or my luggage will get stolen and then I'll just be heartbroken. I think I definitely want to take this one. That, those are great colors. I think I might be able to get away with, yeah, this is like the same color story. So I'm probably just going to take the bottom one because it has more. So I'll take the Hanging in Hawaii. I'm definitely taking the Soft Glam. I'll take this Morphe one, and I think that might be it. One, two, three. I can take three, right? Right? Right. I'm going to be okay just taking three palettes. I'm only gone for two weeks. Okay, I think that's all for this drawer. This is literally how I pack every time. I go through every single one of my drawers, take out what I want to take, and then I, like, narrow it down from there. So you're going to be along with me for the whole ride. Okay, so here we have blushes, bronzers, and highlighters. So I'm not going to take this. It's one of my favorites, but it's already broken. I'll probably take this. This is highlighters, blushes, and uh, bronzers. This is the Physician's Formula um, palette. And then what else am I going to take? I do want creams. I might take these nude sticks. Hmm, let me think. I'm going to take this. This is a Milk Makeup bronzer. What else do I have? I'm going to take this Picante cream because it's um, more compact. So I only have two cream bronzers. And then I have one cream blush so far. I think I'm going to take I have a couple of samples. A sample of Dahlia and Azalea by... Um, rose ink so i'm gonna take those and i'm gonna grab this is one of my most favorite possessions makeup wise this i got from shein and it's 
a set of blushes and they're just the most beautiful they work so well it's ridiculous so i'm gonna take like a lighter one that's a nice color but i probably want more nude or orange yeah that looks i'm gonna take this one and i think that's it i think that'll be enough for highlighters too okay so that's all for this row which gives me anxiety because i'm like it's not enough but of course it's enough okay this is my hair tools I don't think I'm going to bring any actual hair tools with me. I don't do my hair like I usually wear my hair like this when I'm at home. Um, and it's just like curly. I curl it with a hot rod and leave it until I wash my hair because this will last like this curl until I curl my hair. It's amazing. But when I'm on vacation, it takes a lot to curl my hair and I love swimming and I'll be swimming every day and getting my hair wet probably every day. So I'm just trapped with straight hair for two weeks. So I just want to bring some products. So I have a hair oil. I need to bring a good brush. I think my brush is packed for my day stuff today. I think maybe I'll just bring this. Hair brush. This is a strength and moisture leave-in mask. I'll probably take that. And that might literally be it. Oh, this wide tooth comb. Perfect. And I'll pack hair elastics and such later. Okay, I already packed my underwear, which is in this drawer. I already packed my bathing suits, which are in that drawer. And then I have my pants drawer down here. I think I'm only going to bring my Lulu's. Like, it's going to be even hot for that. Like, I don't even know if I would bring jeans. Like, I don't think I'll ever wear my jeans. I'm pretty sure I never wore my jeans when I was there last. So why would I bring, bring them, right? I, I think I'll just bring my Lulu's. And we're back. I know this is weird, and there's like literally a mark in the mirror, like right here, that I can't get off, but you're gonna have to deal, because I was like, this is the best way to film this. Okay, so all of that stuff that I just picked, I put into my new container. Looks great. I put all of my like lip pencils, eyeliners, and lip glosses in here, because I have a separate case for my brushes and then I'm gonna just pick out my concealers my brushes my brushes I still have to wash before I go and then I'm gonna pick out my face stuff look at all this product it's ridiculous okay so we're gonna start with concealers so I'm gonna give my darkest just because I'm gonna be so tan so that's gonna be this one and then probably this one as well and two should be fine that's great and then we're going to do brushes. So I'm going to do my concealer brush, my under eyes brush here. I want probably two foundation brushes because I'm not going to clean them while I'm there. So I'll clean them before. And then let's do a smaller one. And then I want both my um, e.l.f. Putty Primer brushes. Blush. Regular powder. My contour. And that should be good for this. And then I'm going to do a big eyeshadow brush, a smaller eyeshadow brush, a blender, a like tipped with a spoolie, and probably one more like I'll use this double ended brush. So these are all my brushes. I do have to wash these. So I am going to put them in my Jeffree Star makeup case and we'll do that. So this is done. So I'm probably going to keep all of these scents here. I just went ahead and smelled all of my samples. I picked out some of the good samples. And then I'm also going to take some of my favorite perfumes. And I'm going to put them into these perfume alizers. I don't know what they're called. But I already did once. I showed you guys. So I've already done this one. And this one has a daisy in it right now. And then I'm going to pop that into my container. One of these I'm going to leave for Ian. Another one I am going to put... Which scents do I want to put in here? Where are my scents? This one, this is a clean slate by Bath & Body Works. It smells like sea salt. And I have Ed Hardy. Don't make fun of me. I love it. It's the best. And then I'll save one of them. I'll probably save... Maybe not the black one. Ian will probably want the silver one. So I'll save the silver one for Ian. I'm going to bring this new scent that Ian loves. I'm gonna have so many scents, guys. It's gonna be ridiculous. And then let's see if I can just do this as easily as I did the other ones.
I can see it filling up. Look at, can you see that? Also, can you hear those kids? Hilarious. Oh, just squirted. My scents, ready to go. This is for Ian. Pack this garbage. Um, this is my cool new, I showed this to you guys in my Amazon unboxing. Look at, isn't that sweet? Amazing. Freaking love it. Look at, watch. Can you see that? Boom. Magic. Oh, okay. I have to pack hair stuff. Hair elastics. The little ones. Bobby pins. Man, you can hear my boyfriend just like howling with laughter out there. I just adore it. So cute. To skincare. I wonder, can you see? Can you guys see? Okay, which is a lot. I understand I understand that it's a lot, but most of this we're gonna like either get rid of before, like pare it down a little bit, or we're going to use it and throw out the containers while we're there. Because I'll just use that stuff up. Okay, moving right along. So I grabbed some stuff from the like medicine cabinet in the bathroom. I have a bunch of like Cottonelle wipes. I have a bar of soap. I have my travel toothbrush and case. I have another hand sanitizer. This I'll probably be putting in my bag because Ian hates smells of regular hand sanitizer. So I'm going to put those in my purse. Wow, that went in. So did that. Oh, my cat's scratching at the door. In here we have little caps from Lush that are like mouthwash tabs. I have a shower gel. I have a bunch of sleep aids. I have some band-aids. I have floss. I have little things of toothpaste. I have Q-tips. I have a nail file. I have some medicine just in case. I have some nail clippers and that's all good for here. So that'll go in. Now I'm just going to narrow down all of the skin stuff I'm actually going to bring because I've just pulled out way too many things. So I'll be back. We are making a giant mess, but I swear we're on the right track, guys. Stay firm. Stay with me. I don't know why I'm saying that because we're obviously having the best time, right? I have a new drink. I have a bubbly and I also got a keto peanut butter snack, peanut butter cup. Very excited. So grab your beverages, grab your sneakity snacks, and let's go. Okay. So these I got from Amazon, and they're just, Ian built me like a bunch of shelves. I'll try to remember to get an insert here so you can see exactly what I'm talking about. He hang, on, hang on a second. The corporation's in transition. I don't know how YouTubers do it, but we're on the way and I got these so I could have more storage in our what we call the alcove right on top I have I got this from established titles hopefully one day established titles will sponsor me we are officially Lord and Lady Ian Warburton and Laura Burke and then I bought these picture frames online and they don't fit them so I need to buy new picture frames and find pictures for these frames as well. Okay, but this is where I keep, the reason I got this out is because this is where I keep like a bunch of stuff for travel, a bunch of like little um, like to go lotions and stuff like that. So I'm going to go through here and see what out of here or what I want to bring. So in here is going to be my clean unused beauty blenders. As you can see, this is a beaky one, which is one of my favorites. And there's also some Q-tips in here. So I'm going to take red because red is Ian's favorite color. So I just have one beauty blender. I'm going to put it in my cosmetic space. I have a mask. I have another like storage. I have stickers that I got from, I think, where did I get these? Cider. I ordered from Cider and I got a bunch of these stickers. Good vibes. Let's have good vibes, guys. Oh, I have a paw paw as well. I think um, I think I like the beaky ones better. This is Ian's um, eye mask that has music in it. We probably won't bring those. I have a bunch of other eye masks. 
This is my Ole Henriksen lotion that I actually think I'm going to take out and start using. I have a spray deodorant, but I don't need to do that because I have spray deodorant. I have a beauty blender case, which I probably will bring. Hold that. I have a couple backups of the ordinary. This is the amino acid and this is the peeling solution, which I am just going to bring the buffet. So I think that's good enough for all of them. I also have a lactic acid. I have some vitamin E because it's good for your skin to just like get that capsule and take it out of it and rub it all over it like it's a good oil. I have a herbivore pink cloud soft moisture cream. I might just take some samples so I don't have to take this many bottles. See, this is why I do this because I have tons of samples in here. I have Ian's favorite um, shampoo and conditioners by JVN, uh, Jonathan Van Ness, and it really helps with his curls. So what else do I have? I have a little moisturizer, Super Hydrate by e.l.f., but the e.l.f. moisturizer that I have has SPF, so I'm going to take that one. Oh, I'm probably going to take this. This is the Kale and Green Tea Spinach Vitamins Face Wash. This will probably be the, the main face wash that I use while I'm there. It's one of my favorites. And I'll probably take this Briogeo... No, this is a blow dry one. I won't be blow drying my hair while I'm there. So this is a squalene vitamin C rose oil. I might take that because it's tiny. I have a super toner, an elf one. I'll probably bring this because I don't have a tiny toner. I have a micellar water. I will be bringing that just to use it up, right? Um, Ian has a hydrating shampoo one here, but I'll probably, this will probably be the, the one that I pack that's for both of us. Uh, especially because we'll be in the water a lot, so it'll be hard on our hair. All right, what else do I have? Makeup brushes in here I don't need. I have other samples. Makeup brushes, what is this? This is the e.l.f. Super Clarify Cleanser, but I'm not going to be bringing this because I have the other one. This is the Ceramidin Liquid, which is awesome. I actually really like those. I might bring that. I have another... Um, guys this talking thing hand sanitizer this is in Wakiki beach coconut so I'll probably bring this just because it's like tis the season kind of thing I use that phrase for everything tis the season even though it's not Christmas I'm like tis the holiday season but it's summer or tis the season this is a summer Fridays cloud free cream I have an alginist mask see I'll probably bring these tiny samples instead of like that big box of what I was going to bring. I'll bring one little one. This will be perfect. This is why I look in here. Great. What else do we got in here? I have a peel off mask. Not going to be doing that. I have a deep moisture mask, but I probably have a small one of those. And then I have concentrated ginseng. No, I have a youth to the people mask. I'll probably bring that instead of one of the big ones. What is this? I have a Kiehl's Midnight Recovery Concentrate. I'll probably bring this instead of one of the big ones. And then I have a Super Serum, but this is too big. Great. Well, what's in my hand? What was that? What was it? I have the Peptide Polypeptide 121 Future Cream from Youth to the People. I have enough creams, I think, that I'm bringing. I'll just leave this out for now. And then I don't need the Sarah Midden Cream. That's fine. All right, so we're putting all of this back. And all right, this one has so much stuff in it, guys. Okay, so we're gonna bring one of these. This is the like powder puff I told you about that was ripped. So I need to bring one of these. I love these, and they don't like they last so long. I think I'm still literally on my first one. So I'm just gonna put that right in my cosmetics case. And then we have this giant beauty full of stuff. I'm definitely gonna be using this bag. So let's just empty this out and see what's in it. Gonna be using this bag. I have a Juice Beauty Stem Cellular Anti-Wrinkle Retinol Overnight. Nope. I just want, this is a cleanser. This is the Air Dry Cream Hydro Repair Day Cream from the Grown Alchemist. Hydro Repair Day Cream. That sounds good, actually. I'm going to see if I want to use that. Hydrating Conditioner. Nope. Miracle Hair Mask. I think I already have one of those in sample form. I have the Milk Mascara. Oh, yes, I have the milk mascara and I think there's another mascara in here because I have three mascaras that I'm using right now and all three of them are drying up. So that's perfect. So I won't have to bring full sizes. Yes. 
so excited. This is why I do this, guys. All right. This is a turmeric glow moisturizer. I got enough moisturizers. Ooh, I have an Isle of Paradise medium tanning drops. See? So I had a big one here, but now I have a small travel size one. So excited. Okay, putting that away, packing that. I have a Milk Hydro Grip Primer. So excited about this, actually, guys. Wonder if I should bring it. I have those two other primers. I'm just gonna stay with those two other primers. I'm gonna leave that in my backup. I have a Summer Fridays Jet Lag Mask. I might pack that. I have the Innisfree Intensive Hydrating Serum. Might pack that. I have the solid lavender. I'm definitely going to pack this. I'm just going to leave my other one the way that it is because I think this is a smaller packing than my other one. So I'm definitely going to be packing that. Awesome. I'm just going to put my Beaky in this. That looks like pretty freaking full. I might not be able to fit anything in there. This is body cream. I don't need that. Retinol. I don't need that in the sun. Uh, an enzyme scrub. I don't need that in the sun. This is old makeup that I had to go through for a different video. I have my foam case. I have uh, shave gel, which I should probably bring, but I might buy a small one of that. I wish I could make a note. Ooh, because I want to use, I'm filming on my phone, but I want to make a note to be like, buy small um, shave gel, but I'll make a note on my packing list. All right, moving right along. I have nail polish not using. I'm going to get my nails done before I go. This is a sample lotion. Don't need that. Oh, perfect. The Clinique, the small travel Clinique take the day off. This is my favorite. I could not live without this. And this is the travel one. Definitely need that. And what's this? Oh, another retinol perform from. Perfect. I think that's it. And we're moving on to another section. Do you like um, my boyfriend's booth? He is a voice actor and inside there is a really fancy microphone and this blocks out all of the sound so he can do his job. So I have gathered some random things from around the house. Usually what I do when I pack is I'll like walk around my apartment and just look at everything and see if I need it. So this is what I've grabbed. I have a lighter because I have some tea lights. I'm just going to, honestly, it's extra, but I'm going to pack a couple tea lights because romance, guys, romance. Uh, and I have a lighter. I have a deck of cards in case we want to play. I have a glasses cleaner because Ian will absolutely adore that. We both wear glasses. I have this DJI Osmo, so I'm going to try to learn how to use it before we go. I don't want to pack it if I don't know how to use it, but I definitely want to attempt. So I'm going to put that over by the door. I have my wallet. I have my American cash that I've gotten. Putting that in my wallet. And I'm also putting all of my stuff that I'm still going to need to use until then in a purse by the door. I'll transfer it to my backpack later. I have a couple things for the electronic holder. So I have a power bank which I'm gonna put in here, it's by Anchor, and I have a couple wires. So I have like a wire for my headphones, for my tablet, and then for my phone as well. And I just actually ordered two more like fast charging ones for our phones because Ian and I are constantly fighting over the one fast charger we have. So I was just like, fuck it, I'm gonna order two fast chargers so we do not have to like argue over them while we're gone. I'm trying to like put this, it's actually quite finicky. I'm like trying to put this into here. Okay, I can do it, but let's see if we'll, geez Louise. Well, that's this for now. Um, and then the power bank is gonna go in here as well. And I'm gonna zip it up. All right. And then we have three pens because I journal often, especially on holidays, because I have time. So I have my journal, which I'm actually almost done. I'm like almost legitimately done this journal and I want to finish it uh, while we're done. So I hope we do. And then I brought, I picked two like physical books. These are the two that I got. I got one thriller and one like beach read. And then I got 
the artist's way. This is my second time doing it. If you don't know and you're an artist, this is Julia Cameron. Great. It's like a spiritual, what does it tout itself as? A spiritual path to higher creativity. Exactly. Super perfect. And then I have my Kobo and that'll all go in my backpack. And then I have my jewelry case. So I'm just going to start packing some stuff. I have some necklaces over here. I got a bunch of necklaces that I never wear that are super beachy that I don't really care if I lose. So I'm going to put them into, I assume there's a necklace portion. Yeah, right here where you like clip it in here and then put it this way. So I'm going to do, I have my jewelry packed. So this is the jewelry container. And then here I have like watch and then some earrings and a bracelet. And then you open it up and I have all of my necklaces. And then here I have bracelets and then some earrings, rings, earrings. And then in here is going to be also some bracelets and earrings that wouldn't fit. So we are ready to rock. And I would not be sad if I lost every single piece of this because it's mostly crap jewelry. I think I'd be more sad that I lost this like bag that I have. All right, so that is done. So next I have shoes. So as you can see, I have a bunch of shoes like on the back of my door and I'm going to bring flip-flops, like really trash flip-flops and nicer flip-flops and I'm missing a flop. Where's my other flippy? There it is. Yeah. I have one pair of flats that are like nude that'll go with anything. I have one pair of runners that I'm gonna wear on the plane and this I'm gonna use for working out, any of our excursions, yada yada. And then I have one pair of just basic heels, like a shorter, easy, cheap, I don't care if I trash these at all. And then we have sunglasses. So I have my sunglass container here and let's see what sunglasses we have in it so far we have my gucci which i don't really care to bring because they're expensive we have uh my new facetti ones that i specifically bought just for this trip those are definitely coming my new small cat eyes ones that i specifically bought for this trip those are definitely coming i have my pink um i don't know what are these called love these i'll probably bring these and they're pretty trash so i don't really care like some of them are nice and some of them are trash. So I don't really care um, about the trash ones. I'll probably bring these as well. Super, these are like, I'm in the pool swimming. Don't care, trash as well. Um, Ian's gonna need to bring some aviators. So let me see if I can find some. All right, these are my aviators. So I'll probably bring these. I love me some aviators. And then we have Ian's. I'll let Ian pack whatever ones he wants. These are also kind of trash ones. I think I like them though. Yeah. I always want to bring like a million everything, right? As you can obviously tell. Look at these ones. These are cute. What? Impractical for what I'm going there for, but still cute. Okay, these are also a little bit impractical, but like fashion-y. Awesome, but not gonna... And we are rolled up all acts. Oh, guys, that works so well. So excited. All right, so all of that is packed. I can put these back. All my jewelry is packed. Most of my clothes are packed. I'm gonna do like a final clothing thing soon. And that is my second day packing. I'm gonna do one more day for one packing video, just collecting everything, the bits and bobs, and actually probably sloughing off some stuff. Like once I have everything picked out to go, I'll go through everything one more time and just be like, I have two of these, I don't need this. Like just thin it out a little bit so I'm not bringing my entire apartment, which you know, I would love to. There's my boyfriend, perfect timing, bye. Good day and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna do a final pack with me. This is like my third video I've done because I am a packing crazy person and I love it. And I'm going to get everything completely finalized so I don't have to touch it anymore. Uh, except maybe like a couple, like my toothbrush or whatever, you know, all those extra things. So I have a new, I just went to go pick this up. This is our new 
carry-on because we only have one carry-on this blue one right here and I wanted us both to have a carry-on so this is it so grab your beverage of choice today mine is a bubble bubble <laughs> and get ready to pack with me I just double checked my flight information everything looks to be good everything's ready I have like my airport transfer ready they just made it so that you don't have to wear a mask on masks on planes so I'm super stoked about that I think I'll probably end up sleeping on the flight uh, there already ready oh Ooh, this is nice it's tiny but that's fine it's a spinner look at I can probably fit more in my other one but let's look at it lightweight carry on approved 10 year warranty amazing and then I wonder how big it is I got like the biggest one I could find Ooh, it's nice it is very nice Great, I think Ian will probably end up using this as my guess. Because I think mine might be bigger. Let's look. Because I actually, don't worry guys, I'm wearing shorts. I did that on purpose. This is my cute new like sweater dress. I think mine might be bigger. I don't know, they're pretty dang close to each other. I'll probably let Ian have the new one because he'll probably like the rollies, like the four rollies. I bet he'll get down with that. Also, this one, like, this is the old one. This is the new one. It'll be nice for me to give him the new one. Look at it. So nice. Love it. Okay, great. Wow, that moved like a hot damn. Okay, so this is all my clothes. And then I have my actual suitcase, my carry-on, and my backpack i have everything i need in these right now but i just need to reorganize it and maybe pull out a couple things so that they are positioned in the right way so we're just gonna go ahead okay jewelry um shoes makeup i have more makeup over here this is stuff that i kept that i want to bring so it's like my mascaras, I got these new shadow sticks that I just that I did um like a try on with recently. And so I'm gonna put those. And then we have sunscreen, more sandals, makeup, makeup, makeup. This is like a first aid kit that like a makeshift first aid kit. These are my brushes. I have to clean these before I go. Which I really don't want to do you guys so I'm gonna leave these up here and I'll probably just pack that in my backpack because that's what I'm carrying with me this is my sunglasses container my clean towels and my hairbrush is there anything in here what's in here oh one of my purses I think I'm gonna pack most of my clothes in here this is my beach towel my fanny pack with stuff in it my other bags great let's unpack this I got a magazine I got a loofah that I just bought so I can put that in here a little travel um, shape gel pen piece of paper I also got a chocolate because who doesn't want chocolate all right Oh, I finally got my Slim Airs book, guys. I'll show you in depth another time. But I was talking about this. Things to still pack. Number one is a razor. All right, I'm just gonna leave this here. Oh, brushes. Makeup brushes. After I wash them. I'm gonna use the word wash lightly because I don't usually wash them. I don't wash them. I like clean them. Like I use the cinema secrets, which is like a blue liquid that like cleans them out. This is empty. Moving here for now. In here. 
more magazines. And I'll probably still buy more at the airport. Because who doesn't like to be by the pool reading a magazine? My hat that I washed. I had to wash this and I did. My bag, which I washed. Okay, I narrowed down. I have my Kobo, which I need the charger for. I have two pens in here. I have my like facial pack. I have the artist's way, the vacationers, the wives, and my journal. And then that's everything that's in here. I'm gonna ask my boyfriend to figure out how to charge this. Because you're supposed to be able to charge this backpack somehow. Okay, so while my boyfriend figures out that backpack, what it is, it's just a cord that will tra travel from my portable charger to like the actual backpack so I can just plug something into the side of my backpack, which is cool. Okay, so now I'm gonna unpack this and see what we have. Ooh. Okay, we have, oh, this is the scale, um, the luggage scale, so I'll leave that up over here. We have the fan, so that's just gonna get packed. I have my pills, so I need to pack that, like final pack that. I have the locks, so I'll just lock everything when I'm done. And then I have the luggage tags, I wanna fill these out. And then I have two hand sanitizers. And that's it for this Shein bag. This is gonna be my toiletries. This is the electronics, so I'm gonna leave this out because we need to fill that with more. Um, I need to wash this sponge, so I'm gonna leave that up here with my brushes. Okay, this is gonna be a pain in the butt. This is the um, floaty. Hopefully my boyfriend will let me pack it in his luggage because that would be great. He's shaking his head over there. We'll see about that. All right. Oh, we need to get your luggage out, babe. Okay, so this stuff that's already packed in here, I'm gonna leave because there's no need to unpack that. It's just like underwear and bathing suits and stuff. All right. Okay, I got my sun hat, flip-flops, flats, more flip-flops. This is, oh, this is my bathing suits. Uh, runners, which I'm actually gonna wear on the plane and I think I'm gonna clean them before I go. They are quite dirty, so I'm gonna leave those out. And then, oh, perfect, he's got it fixed. And then I have my only heels that I'm bringing. I'm bringing one pair of heels. Sounds crazy, but it's true. One pair. Uh, and then these are my Lulus. And I'm gonna bring these. I might wear these on the plane and then just bring a change of clothes. Thanks, babes. So my empty one, and then it just clips in on the side right here. Oh, cool. Awesome. And then you just added a charger for our phones. So I guess once our phones are there, we can just put it in the side pocket right here or in the back. Yeah, that would probably be even better at the back because then it's like hidden. Great. Okay, I'm going to unplug this because we're probably going to need this for a little bit. Awesome. All right. And then I have my cosmetics case. And that is everything for my main luggage. And now it's my clothes, which is really gonna be the crux of it all. So I'm gonna take this makeup. I think I need to leave one of these mascaras out. Yeah, I'm gonna leave this, my good mascara out because I can't, I cannot take them all before I go and don't leave for another four days. And then I'm gonna put the rest of these mascaras just in this bag. As soon as I get into the hotel room, I'll unpack that's my jam I love that okay so now we have our clothes I'm just gonna empty all these and see what I can what I can ah, take and what I can leave look at this giant pile of clothes that I'm expecting to bring and I'm just gonna roll through what we have here I have one t-shirt which is gonna be great it's a big t-shirt I can sleep in it and inside the room will be air conditioned and Ian runs hot, so it'll probably be on cold rather than hot most of the time. I have another t-shirt. This is my Halloween t-shirt. It's gonna be like Halloween time while we're there, so I want to be able to wear it this season. I have a super cute Shein outfit. This is, um, this is a long like slit skirt. 
and it has a top with it too. He really likes this dress, so that's why I brought it. Nice skirt. I have another like um, long skirt with like a bandeau top that I got from Shein. So it's a double. I have not worn this yet. There are two outfits, this outfit and this outfit that I have not touched yet and I'm so excited. Like so excited. Okay, this is another like coordinated set. This is a, like a skirt. So cute. Like top here that I can wear as soon as I get there. So I'm gonna put flip flops. With this, that's gonna be so easy. Okay, I'm gonna put this in the front so as soon as we land, I can put that on. Um, like a tighter t-shirt for inside the um, air conditioned room. I'll probably end up sleeping and stuff like this because I will end up being cold. Is my guess. Like a really beautiful like slip dress. Oh, so cute. This is like um, a comfy, relaxed, coordinated set in this like burnt orange color. It has the like comfiest shorts that go with it. This is the bandeau from the other outfit that I already put in. This is a beautiful little like slip dress to go over top of bathing suits. I have like a little crop top sports bra thing, a little like apron t-shirt. This is part of a two-piece Italian dress. You guys have definitely seen this. So cute. I have the most beautiful clothes. I'm so excited. Guys, we leave in four days. By the time you see this, we will already be in Mexico. Ah! Follow me on Lola Bonita 22 on Instagram. See my stories. This is like a halter dress it's so young it's so cute I completely dress young which I think is totally fine alrighty see-through skirt that I can wear over my bathing suit this needs to go in my big one the jewelry can go in here um, these are the little clips these will probably go in here too my brush might as well in here and we're just gonna keep going with clothes I have this uh, other coordinate so cute and it also has a top that goes with it the shorts white shorts like canvas shorts super cute I have like a blue crop top I have like a canvas dress I think that's all I can go in here coordinated set guys I I'm all about the cords obviously I love fashion in general like it's really fun to me. We still got a little ways guys. We still got a little ways. I have a romper, those flats, shoes, and I think that should be it. Let's see. Oh yeah. Like I could even probably fit more, but we're not gonna, we're not gonna go ham just yet. This is most of my clothes, a couple of my shoes, my jewelry. So that's great. Packed, packed. Now we have our main suitcase. So the first thing I'm gonna be packing is all of this big stuff in it and then packing everything else essentially around it as it fits. So I have most of my toiletries, my other toiletries, makeup, makeup. Um, this is that stuff I just opened. I have my beach stuff, I have a purse. I have the first aid kit, I have shoes, I have sandals, this I'm going to pack last, hat, hat, sunglasses, so I'm going to put my sunglasses in here, put these on top of it, and then I'm going to try to stuff, like all this stuff in the sides, right, so I can put it in. This is a beach cover up, I have a pair of Ian's shorts, which I'm actually going to leave out for him, leave out for him. This is a super cute, like, bandeau kind of corset looking top. I have just, like, regular slummy shorts so we can go do, like, an excursion. I'm not going to bring these. I'll probably wear the other ones more. Um, I have a black set of high-waisted shorts. 
I have my one sports bra I'm bringing. This is the other half of my coordinated set, the burnt orange one. And then, man, my nails ripping so bad. I'm so glad I'm getting them done tomorrow. It's been a hot minute. I have a denim skirt. Let's see how we're fitting in this side. It's so tightly packed in there. Okay, on the other side, I'm going to put this floaty. I know it takes up so much room, guys. I know, I get it, I understand that, but it was like $60 Canadian. I'm not spending another $60 Canadian for a floaty, and I need a floaty. If I'm gonna be spending two weeks in Mexico, I need a floaty. Okay, so, oh, this is so cute. What a cute, adorable, like, apron dress. I love this is a cute dress, I love this dress. So cute, so flattering. Hopefully Ian can put that in his bag. Please, babe, please, just that, just that. Palette, that's for my bag, and that's it. So just this, I can, I can fit that in there, I believe. My Lulu's I'm gonna wear, that's it. My backpack. So there's actually, this is such a massive backpack, and there's not tons that I need to bring in here. All my books, my Kobo is gonna go in here. I need to charge that first. My mask that I'm gonna wear on the plane. All right, this is my like bag that I put in every purse that I have. So let's just empty this out. So I have my pills, which I'm going to fill that pill container instead of this one. This is Hand sanitizer, hand sanitizer, hand sanitizer, dry mouth spray, hand sanitizer, gum, um, compact foundation. This is going to be too light for me, so I'm going to leave this here. Mouthwash, um, eye drops, chocolate, chocolate, hand sanitizer, hand sanitizer, mint, more hand sanitizer, um, blotting spray, sunscreen, contacts, lip gloss. A poof which yeah I can use that this is blotting um, perfume a knife <sighs> guys if I brought this with me that'd be trouble we're gonna leave that here lotion a tampon this is like a ginseng like hooter it's for natural energy there's no drugs or anything in it but I'm gonna leave that home a pen um, a little tiny beauty blender and then I'm probably going to put all of these hand sanitizers in like one thing. This is just one of the travel bottles that I bought and it has a tiny like spout. So I'm just going to pour all of these into here. This is just hand sanitizer. Let me see if this works. Great. So excited, awesome. Okay, I'm gonna bring this in here. This I'm gonna put in the front. Yay, thank you for finishing up this pack with me. Don't forget to like join me for the rest of my vacation. This is like, I literally did like three pack with me videos that I'm putting into one. And this was the final one, like I'm ready to go. Other than like cleaning my brushes and putting my brushes away and convincing my boyfriend to put one of my <laughs> things, that one, into his suitcase then we're good everything has been packed my my luggage doesn't weigh more than 50 pounds and we leave in four days i'm very very excited very excited feel very blessed thanks for watching subscribe give me a thumbs up and much love my boyfriend's dancing over there get it babe get it love you bye